Alright guys, welcome back. We have another MTB Pro unboxing today. That's right, MTB Pro. But first, I want to go over, I got, uh, I just got the subscription for the Guggen Squad like t-shirt thing that they're doing. And because I'm a part of Team Guggen um, with their like uh, promo team or whatever it may be, I ordered this bad boy and got, and because I'm a part of that, I get a lures and I get a t-shirt every month. Uh, you know what? Let's um, do this real quick. Hey, hey, all right. See, there we go. Guggen Motor Company. Uh, pretty cool. You know, your guide to the, uh, I don't even know what, since 85. I don't know what that means, but I think it's a kind of a cool t-shirt. Uh, and they also send over some Guggen base. These are 10-inch Mondo worms in um, Red Bug. So we'll be using these soon on hopefully another video those off to the side but let's get right into the video let's get into this month's MTB Pro unboxing now this month of course they send me the little majigger that I need to tell you what everything is so that's awesome and let's get right into it uh, the Mike Bucca's baby bull shad um, this is eh, I'm not gonna lie so last month was probably the best month that we've gotten thus far for these lures this one looks pretty okay is it amazing no is it good? Yes, and I think this is the best lure of the bunch. Let's kind of fast forward so it's open. All right, so we have this really cool colored bull shad. Um, I think this thing looks awesome, guys. It's pretty simplistic, obviously, right? It's a swim bait um, with some big, it looks like uh, long shank, maybe those are fours, it looks like, um, hooks on it. And it, it looks good, it looks really good. Uh, the tail, if you see this here, is a uh, like a hair type tail. So this is gonna be pretty sweet. Uh, I am gonna do, of course, the MTB slam on this bad boy. So taking these out of the box is a part of the game plan and exactly what we're gonna do. Uh, they list this for $14.95 or $14.99, I should say. And uh, yeah, I definitely think that's probably worth about the $14 or so. Uh, we've got the Booyah Hard Knocker. You guys all know this one. Just another rattle trap, guys. Um, I mean, just another rattle trap, but it's a nice rattle trap. Uh, they list it here for six, $6.99, uh, but of course it's going to have the must-had KVD really good freaking hooks on it. Looks like a bluegill. I think the coloring on it's really, really nice. It's got that big red eye. Uh, these are dope. These are super cool. I, uh, I can't hate on this. It's got a nice little shimmer to it, the dark hooks. Uh, I don't feel like this is the right time of year for this. This is more of a uh, an early springler, but uh, I'm not going to hate on it, and I still think we can catch fish on it. So. We're definitely going to use that. I think it's surprising to say that this and the bull shad are kind of similar in size. All right, next we've got the Big Bite Trick Sticks. This is interesting. This is a neat one for me. Orange Sankos. Orange Sankos, guys. Did you ever expect to see orange Sankos? I don't think so. But I know uh, this is kind of a favorite color. Wow, look at the wackiness on that thing. This is a great little color here. Um, I don't think that the camera gives us justice on how orange this really is. But um, pretty cool. I think we're gonna have to give this a shot. I don't know if this color is gonna work or not, but for the MTV Slam, I think this is gonna be dope. Next up, we have the Star Jigs Swim Jig. It looks awesome. I'm really excited to throw this bad boy. I think this thing's gonna get me hooked. Ow! Look at the coloration on this beast, huh? It looks like it's an um, excessive skirt. Like they added a lot of material here for the skirt. I think that looks great. To me, this doesn't look like a swim jig. The box does not, half ounce crusher craw. Um, I don't feel like this is a swim jig. It just doesn't have the right look for being a swim jig. Like it sits obviously like this. So it's clearly a traditional jig. But wow, I'm getting glitter all over myself from this thing. Yeah, see all this glitter? I've gotten it all over my hands from this bad boy. A lot of glitter, um, really shiny. I think it's a really nice looking jig. I just think they're misrepresenting it as a swim jig. It's not a swim jig. This is definitely like a all around standard jig. We're gonna kind of skip to the Excite Baits 
uh, chunk trailer because this thing is what's gonna go with that. This little beast, they only give you three? Three for 250. Are you serious? Whatever. These look great as a chunk trailer to me. Uh, great color. It kind of looks like, like a green pumpkin. Rotten pumpkin's what they call it. It's like a dark green pumpkin. It looks really good. Um, but three? Really? This is one of those sampler packs that we've talked about before. I don't like sampler packs in my MTB box. Give me real stuff. It's okay. I think the color's good. I think it's gonna work great on the jig. 250 though? I don't think so. Moving on. Uh, next we've got the Riot Baits Little Fuzzy. But, you know, I think this looks pretty cool. It's a great little color. Green pumpkin. Um, do they even call it green pumpkin? Let's look here. They don't have a color listed. I hate that. We've talked about this. Get a color listed. But the lure itself looks great. Uh, there's only four another sampler pack, but we have four or three hard baits so far and two soft plastics, three soft plastics. It's not a terrible deal. This is gonna be overpriced as well. They're listing this at 350 for four pieces. So almost a dollar a piece. They're going almost a dollar a piece on this. That's a little excessive. Last and not least, we have another big bite. Uh, this is what they call the Smalley Smasher. Smalley Smashers. Let's see here. What do we got? This is a little drop shot guy, but they at least list this properly. You get, looks like five of these in the in this little bag, but at least they're listing it at $1.66. Um, and it's just a little drop shot rig. So nothing too crazy. Again, in a great color. I love green pumpkin. Green pumpkin's my jam. It's what we do around here. But, uh, really with the, yeah. I think the hard baits are amazing. I think those soft plastics are a little weak for the most part, except for this massive bag of, of worms. I don't know how they can justify this being 449 and this over here being 349. This is like three times heavier than this at minimum. So if you're talking about raw plastic, this has way more in it. It's, it's whatever, but let's just say, all in all, I think it's a good box. I'm really excited about the bull shad. I think this is awesome. Uh, I think this jig is a, an incredibly sparkly jig that I think will catch fish rather well. So I think I've got at least two great lures out of the box. We're supposed to be using this in a way to have more options, throw new lures. So that's exactly what this is gonna be. Exactly what that's gonna be. Um, crazy color, I love that there's one crazy color in here, one kind of crazy out the box lure. I do think that three of the soft plastics are a little overpriced, a little silly. But again, samplers, we know I've talked about that before. I don't like samplers in my MTB box, but this is worth, I think, the whole box in my opinion. So, is there anything else in here? Oh, there is more in here. Hold up, we missed something here. We missed the Harmony hooks. Okay, so I've looked over this long enough. This is Harmony Fishing Company's offset hooks. Now, I'm gonna try and show you this. All right guys, so inside of this bag, do you see these little rings right here? These are designed to go on the hooks from what I'm seeing here to help keep the bait on the hook longer. That, I think, is something very revolutionary. That's different. This is awesome. They list this at 349. I think uh, for four hooks, that's probably about right, especially because it comes with all these little rings. The hooks are pretty large. These are gonna be three odd, but they look like four odds to me. They look huge. But these little rings are what's really important here. I think this is gonna be kind of awesome. So they've actually given us everything that we need to fish all of the soft plastics, except for the drop shot type deal. But all in all, pretty good box. If I gave it a number, I'd say eight out of 10. Mm, seven and a half out of 10? Seven and a half out of 10, just because of preference purposes. So other than that guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you like this box. Tell me in the comments down below what your favorite lure is, what you would throw the most, and what you like. And until next time guys, happy foozin. Um, this is in what they call, I don't know the name of the color, I can't pronounce it, so 
you guys can figure it out on your own.